No matter what kind of retaining wall you're building, they're only as strong as the footing they sit on. If the footings fail, the wall will definitely fail. But Adbrise solved a lot of our problems by inventing the torpedo block. Now it's a bit like me. It's big and heavy and it's not real pretty, but it works. And the reason why it works is because it's nice and wide, so you've got a big wide footing. This can replace road base or even concrete in a lot of examples when you're building retaining walls. The reason why it's got a concave and a convex end is because they can sit into each other nicely. If you line up the grooves that you see on the end, you get them dead straight. If you turn the grooves around, you can get even curves. Now, they've got these lugs on the side, which will fit your fingers, but I reckon picking them up and sticking your fingers in there is just as good. So the torpedo can make the job easier. It means you don't have to deal with another supplier to get road base or even concrete. And if you are working with road base, there's the extra cost of hiring a whacker. By bedding them on sand, it means it's got a bit of give in it. I can get them dead level across this way with a small level and dead level this way with a longer one. And I'm just doing a gentle curve here. So what that means is I'm lining it up with the first lug that's off centre with the one that's in the back side of it. The torpedo blocks have given us our footing and now we can start on our retaining wall. Now Ed Bryan make a couple of different types of systems. You can see this one here has got a little lip on it. So it's dead easy to put the block down, slide it forward until the lip bites, and then you can start building your wall. No adhesive needed. But if you're using something like the Versa wall, you have a look at the back side of that, it's dead flat. So it sits on here dead flat and it can move a little bit. Put it in the center, get it to the spot where you want it, and then you need to flip it over. And the reason why is because you need an adhesive like liquid nails. Now what I do, there's nice even blobs, evenly spaced out. You can get carried away and put more on than that, but what I've used is absolutely enough. And it's important that your blobs are even from one end to the other. Reason why is when you put it down, big blobs at one end and little blobs at the other will change your levels on you. Torpedo, it's the new way to do footings for an Adbri retaining wall. Good luck.